Hello, welcome back to Spice and Easy. Noodles, it's a noodle day. Right, we've got, we've done the hot ones uh, from Korea. Um, Samyang Bulldak noodles, I think. At the minute, they are my favorite noodles uh, in a pot. Spicy, tasty, and at the same time, I've not got around to doing the review till now, we've got these. Uh, which we're going to be doing now. Instant shin hot and spicy flavour. Shin cup noodle soup. That one. Now it's by Nong Shin. Nong Shim. Shin cup noodles. Gourmet spicy. I'm assuming they are the same. Right, Grandad glasses. Because I can't sniff all the other things. Right, what do you do with this? I don't know. Can I actually see on here what you're supposed to do with it? Let's have a quick look. Let's undo it. <laughs> it's on the lid. That's why I can't see it on the side. Open lid halfway, add soup base, pour boiling water up to the inside line, close lid and wait for three minutes, stir well and serve. That's it, that's all there is to it. So, let's boil the kettle and let's do what it says and let's see how good they are. We're done. Ready, ready for digging in. I've actually given it more. It's had about four to five minutes. So we'll give it a good stir. I like to give them a bit longer because sometimes they're not quite cooked. Now it is, well it does say soup, so it is a bit runnier than the, the bulled out ones we tried. And I'll cook nice, they're a lot steaming. Quite a lot of veggie stuff in there as well, dehydrated veg that they put in. And it does smell, steamy glasses, it does smell similar to the bulled out ones. I uh, don't think they're going to be as hot, but give it a real good mix. And let's see, I do prefer the, I mean, it's no contest, pot noodle or one of these. This is going to win every time. Should have had my chopsticks, shouldn't I? So, let's see. Oh, I'm messy eating these things. Trying to do it this way so I don't have to like you're supposed to do. I know that's the way they do it, but. A uh, bit of heat there. Not a lot, uh, quite mild. Uh, but it doesn't say it's hot, it says gourmet spicy. Now that, to me, is perfect wording on this. I can't knock them because they put gourmet spicy. And yes, the spicy, it's got a spicy taste, but it's not hot. And they don't claim to be really hot. So, bang on, thumbs up for your, your wording on your labels, you're not claiming to people that it's really hot when it's not spicy, which it is. Mm. Noodles cook really nice. If you do try one of these, I recommend, as I always do, peel it back as it tells you, put your water in, your sachet in, close the lid, lid, lid again, and put the fork on top just to hold it down, stop the steam lifting this up, and then Tends to cook a bit better, and I always leave it for a couple of minutes longer than it says, if you've got the time. Now, noodles, as I say, cook really good. Flavour, spicy. Similar flavour to the Bulldak, but obviously not as hot. Now, I'm going to drink some of this juice to get the full flavour. There's a bit of heat there. Definitely a bit of chilli coming through. Um, 
It's not hot. Overly, anyway. Um, it's spicy, as it says. Again, curry-wise, if you only ever eat korma, uh, you could... Well, I don't know if you would manage them, actually, because it is quite spicy. Um, it may be a bit hot for you. If you're tikka masala, it's going to be spicy, but you should be okay. If you're a medium or above in a curry, you're going to be fine, and you're going to enjoy them, because these are getting a thumbs up again. Really, really good. Uh, nice flavour, nice spicy taste, and it's not just chilli. You, you are getting a nice taste with it, and it's hot enough. It doesn't claim to be anything more. Just spicy, and it is. Now, granddad time again. Just want to check. They have put some of the writing in red. It's on a red background and you can't really read it. Yeah, Korea. So they are Korean again. Uh, also with the Samyang. Korea, see to me. Donkey noodles, don't they? If ever I went out to Korea, I'd, t I'd just live on noodles, I think. This is really nice. It's got the thumbs up. Same as the bulldog. But can you imagine being out there and eating fresh noodles that they make themselves? Mmm. I wouldn't want to come back if I went out there. Yeah, really nice. Shin cup. Instant noodles, Korean. Gets the thumbs up, recommended. I think price wise they're about a quid. Got them from Tesco, so you don't have to go to specialised shops. Uh, and I got the Bulldog ones from there, they've still got them as well, so I'm getting some more of them when I go over. Um, recommended, yes. If you like noodles, you like pot snacks, and it's convenient, this knocks the hell out of a pot noodle, trust me. Try them. Really nice, spicy flavour, not too hot, so long as you can manage uh, above a mild, just just below medium strength wise, you'll be fine with them. Uh, they're not really, really hot. And I have, I'm going to go and enjoy the rest of these. We'll catch you later.